In this video, I want to discuss uh, the process of fermentation, alcohol fermentation. Uh, when we go through this, uh, we'll begin ourselves with the first stage of, say, a restoration of glycolysis. But there's some things I want to remind you guys of. We want to look at just one thing as a reminder. Every time I begin these lessons, I want to look at and remind ourselves oxidation reduction reactions. And I gave you guys a little saying. Leo the lion says, grr. Leo the lion says, grr. Loss of electrons oxidation. Gain electrons reduction. Leo Gur. And this will give you guys a kind of a good construct to go ahead and begin our cells with this. And we'll begin with the sugar glucose C6H12O6. And glucose will go through the process of glycolysis. And I'll give you guys just a little um, little abbreviation of glycolysis. Now how that is done, we are actually expelling some phosphorylation here when I have uh, ATP produced, when I actually bring in two ADPs plus two phosphates, two organ inorganic phosphates, and glycolysis proceeds. When that is done, glycolysis we know makes two pyruvate, two pyruvate, two pyruvic acid molecules. And this pyruvic acid, uh, when we go through this process of taking pyruvate, if we are in the presence of no oxygen, we'll continue down and we'll make two molecules of acetaldehyde. Now I'm just going to take acetaldehyde and abbreviate it because I don't have a lot of room, acetaldehyde. And what we're going to do is convert acetaldehyde into ETOH, ethyl alcohol. Now, how do we do that? Now, we know we, when we are doing glycolysis, there's something missing here. I haven't filled it in yet. We take a very strong reducing agent that we're going to bring in here, um, and uh, we're going to bring an electron carrier. An electron carrier, 2 NAD+. Plus. We bring in two of these guys. When they come in and interact with glucose, they help to produce the pyruvate, and this is just a small part of what happens here. And we make ourselves two NADHs. And this produces some of the protons that will be used. And when this guy, who is now an electron carrier, is a very strong, this is the reduced state here, the strong oxidizer here, and this guy will come in and get back into oxygen, it will become an oxidized. So NADH oxidation, when we reduce acetaldehyde into ethanol, we reduce it by taking our strong reducer in, Reduced state becomes a strong oxidizer, which reduces acetaldehyde into ethyl alcohol. So this ought to give you, now this is in one organism, generally, is yeast, and this is the one we care about the most, but this is alcoholic fermentation. We'll look at other kinds of fermentation, other processes of this, but this is what I would want you guys to know for your general biology courses, and this concludes my video on alcoholic fermentation in yeast, Saccharomyces cerevisiae.